temperatures bring that cold uh, air from the Gulf of Alaska down into our area. So clear and cold overnight. And then after this cold snap, we have a wet spell coming. This uh, frontal system moving our way will bring our next uh, bout of rainfall that arrives on Thursday. So let's begin our animation at 5 o'clock tomorrow afternoon, at which point most of the Bay Area will still be dry, but we'll see the first uh, sprinkles of rain developing up in the far northern part of our viewing area. And then uh, during the evening uh, and late night hours, Wednesday, we'll see rain pretty much confined to the North Bay and, and pretty far north as well, around uh, Sonoma County for the most part. But by 5 o'clock Thursday morning, the beginning of rush hour, we'll see the rainfall pushing south and down towards the Golden Gate. Then during the day on Thursday, we'll see the rain intensifying in the North Bay first and then sweeping southward by 5 o'clock Thursday afternoon as the uh, afternoon and evening rush begins. We'll see heavier, steadier rain in the North Bay beginning to sweep southward during the evening hours Thursday, the overnight hours. All parts of the Bay Area will get wet by morning, 5 o'clock. It'll be very wet for the commute. So we'll stop the animation at uh, 5 o'clock Friday morning, at which point rainfall total could be up to 4 inches. Nice. Up to an inch. The Santa Cruz Mountains, 1 to 2 inches. Generally, nice. Bay, maybe as much as half an inch in the, in the East Bay, but only about 2 tenths at the most in the South Bay. Meanwhile, in the Sierra, we have a winter storm watching effect from Thursday afternoon to Saturday afternoon. We can see 2 to 5 feet of snow, about 4,000 feet, several inches in lower elevation. Chain controls and travel delays are certainly likely. Back in the Bay Area tomorrow, the chill is on. High temperatures only in the low 50s for much of the Bay Area tomorrow. And down near Monterey, Bay, just a little bit milder, low to mid 50s. Here's the IP Weather 7 day forecast. So the rain begins on Thursday, continues on Friday and on Saturday. Rain and showers on Sunday, finally drying out on Monday, which is Christmas Eve, so the dry weather will be a nice Christmas gift. And it looks like it'll stay dry on Monday.